What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the player count in Red Dead Redemption 2 and how it's had some of its highest numbers ever recorded recently. Uh, back in November, so just a couple months ago, the game recorded its high, highest ever concurrent player count on Steam. The count was 67,492 concurrent players, which beat the previous high player count of 55,271, which was set in 2019 when the game was released. So that's when the game came out. That was the very first day the game came out, the very first couple weeks. And the game is now hitting higher player counts. But to even beat that, uh, just a few days ago on the 9th of January, the concurrent player count was just shy of 70,000 players. So this shows you there's a lot of people still interested in Red Dead Online, Red Dead Redemption 2 on the PC side. Now it was recently on one of the Steam uh, kind of discount uh, days they have you know they sell games for really cheap but the crazy thing about this is a lot of these numbers came out long after uh, the sale was over so there are still people buying this game even after it was off you know off sale it was on sale still I'm interested to see how many players are on console of course that's what I play on I started playing the game on PS4 but play it on PS5 now when I do play I know a lot of people out there still play on Xbox old gen or new gen consoles there's really no way to track the player base on console i still see a you know lobbies full when i go in there, there's never like a small amount of players on playstation their lobbies always seem to be pretty full uh, but i don't think it's going to be quite the, the the way that it is on, on on pc i don't think there's that many players playing red dead on console compared to pc and i do think a lot of it is because pc does have mods and other things they can do but I'm kind of hoping this will revitalize the game and get players back into playing it once they hear about everyone playing again, no matter what platform they play on. Now, will it make Rockstar make some more content for the game? I highly doubt it, and that is the sad thing. But there's other games out there that have lasted a long time, at least on the PC side. If you look at Skyrim, that game has been out forever, been modded to death, and people still play it. I think it will last longer on PC personally than it will on console and the less Rockstar decides to come in and make some changes and make some more updates to the game, some major updates. But I still kind of worry that they're really concentrating right now on that new GTA game and not on Red Dead Online, which is kind of a shame because Red Dead Redemption 2's campaign as a whole was probably one of my favorite games ever. I, I love the Red Dead series. All of the campaigns have been great. And Red Dead Online is very enjoyable if you like that type of, uh, of idea, if you like that type of game, and if you have friends to play with, or you just like the Red Dead world in general. It is a very fun experience. So leave me a comment with your thoughts. Let me know what you think about this player base. Let me know if you're still playing the game, if you've played it lately. And of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.